So whether you are a student, a content creator, or just someone looking to present the information in a visually stunning way, then this tool has got you covered. So in just a few clicks, you can turn the plain text into the eye-catching visuals that will grab your audience attention without needing any kind of designing skills. So without any further delay, let's quickly get started. All right, so the tool name is napkin.ai. You can simply type napkin.ai in the search and you will be coming to this website. And it says get visual from your text. Napkin turns your text into visual so sharing your ideas is quick and effective. And if you want to read about it, then you can read it. Now here, in order to use it, you will have to click on get napkin for free. Then it will ask you, you want to sign up with the Google or you want to sign up with the email. So click on sign in and sign in with your desired Google or any other email account. And once you have successfully signed in, it will give you two different options when you click on the new napkin here. Draft with AI or the blank napkin. I will be explaining both of them, so don't worry. Let's start with the draft with AI option. Then it says generate text using the AI. So first you have to give the prompt here that what kind of uh, text you want to generate for which you need the images for which you need any kind of diagram or any kind of infographic. So for the demonstration purpose, I will write here how brain works in a human body. OK, I'm just taking an example here. This can be anything depending that what kind of infographics or text you want to generate. So once you have given your prompt, you will have to click on continue. And the napkin will start generating the text for you within few seconds only. All right, and here we go. So you can see that how quickly and how systematically they have created the text here along with the outline, with the heading. So you can see how the brain works. It has given us the intro here. The structure of the brain according to the category, how the brain communicate, brain function and homeostasis, cognitive functions, and then finally with the conclusion. So once the text has been generated, now in order to create the infographic, what you have to do, first select the intro here. And the moment you select the intro, on the left hand side, you will find the AI icon here that says generate the visual. So you will have to click on it. And very soon it will start generating the visual for this particular text. And on the left hand side, you can see different options here. It has generated multiple infographic. So whichever you like the most, you can select it. If you want to go with this one, then you can go with this one. So if you want to go with this one only, then you can keep to this one. Then we have another next. All right. So let's see if I want to go with this one, then I will simply click on it. Again, it will give me some other format and theme of the same infographic. Like if I want to go with the black and white, then I can go with this one. Then we have this kind of image here. All right. I can choose any one of them and bingo. So you can see the infographics has been successfully created here. Now, part of this, you can also manage it. You can rearrange it. If you want to rearrange the size, if you want to change the color, then you can also do that and so on. There are many other features that you can try. All right. Once you are done with this text, now you can come down, choose the other text area. Again, from the left hand side, click on generate visuals and it will start creating the visual for this particular text. And again, you can see that it has given several uh, format here that you can check. There are many of them. So whichever you want to choose now, you can simply select it. And if you want to rearrange it, if you want to change the color, then you can also do that. Next, I will come to the how brain communicate. Again, I will select the text. Then from the left hand side, you have to click on the generate visual options. And again, it will start generating the infographic for this particular text. And again, we have many kind of recommendation here. So choose the one that you want to go with. And if you want to rearrange, then you can rearrange it. Then we will come to the brain function and the homeostasis. I will select it, click on generate infographics. And again, the infographics has been generated. All right. And now finally, we can go with this cognitive function as well. So again, I will select the text and click on generate visuals. Choose the visual from here. Select it. Bingo. So now you can see that we have the fantastic 
presentation here with the text and along with the infographics here that we generated in few minutes only and for absolutely free. So this is our title here. This is the introduction along with the infographics. Then we have the next category, the structure of the brain with the infographics and the text. Then we have another category here with the infographics. Another text with another infographics. Another text with another infographics. In case if you only need the infographics only, not the text, then you can select it and you will get the download button here. You can click on it and download the infographics from here only. In case if you need the infographics for attaching into any videos, then you can also do that. Okay. In case if you don't need a presentation, only need the infographics. But if you need the full presentation here, then you are all done. Now on the right hand corner, you will find the share option. Click on it and then you will get the download PDF option. Click on it again and it will ask you single continuous page or A4 pages. So I can go with the A4 pages and click on export. And here we have the PDF of the presentation that we created. And it looks so amazing guys with the text, with the images, with the infographics. And it's a proper presentation that you can share and submit anywhere that you want to. If you need this kind of material for the teaching, then the material is ready for you. All right. So very interesting. And now let's go back. Click on the new napkin here. And instead of draft with AI, we will go with the blank napkin. It will ask you the text here. So type anything for which you want the presentation. So I will type here difference between the physical cores and the logical core in computer processors. So I want to generate the infographic here for the topic difference between the physical core and the logical core in the computer processor. So this will be my heading here. So if I need the infographic or the diagram only for this particular topic, then what I can do, I can select it. Click on generate visuals. And this will generate some infographic for you. Whichever you like the most, you can select it. Then you can reshape it. Or if you want to edit it, then you can also do that. Below also you get many options here. Like if you want to add any kind of images, then you can add it. You can add any kind of a sketch. You can add any kind of label. Or you can spark any kind of search. Alright, so once you are done, now you will have to simply select it. And you get the download option here. Click on the download. It will ask you the format you want to download in the PNG format, SVG or the PDF. Select it. Then the color mode you want for the light mode, for the dark mode, then you can choose that. Then click finally on download here. And your infographics will be quickly downloaded here. And this all you can enjoy for absolutely free guys. So if you have any kind of requirement where you have to create the presentation along with the infographics or any kind of diagram or your videos or anything, then go ahead and try them right now. So hopefully guys you enjoyed the video, found this information useful, if yes, make sure that you hit the like, subscribe and I see you in the next video. Bye bye.